The modular junction is a modulation expander Max for Live device for Ableton Live. Designed to add new functionality to your workflow, the modular junction provides a myriad of modulation tools that can augment existing hardware and software devices. The modular junction provides a selection of modulation sources that can be mapped to any parameter in live or patched to any CV based hardware instrument or a DC coupled audio interface. The modular junction is designed to spark creativity, add new possibilities to both familiar or new software instruments and audio effects and offers new modulation sources for compatible hardware modular instruments. The modular junction utilizes various algorithmic techniques to generate modulation sources. Via the modular junction MIDI effect, these sources can be mapped to any Ableton or third-party instrument. Via the modular junction audio effect, these sources can be mapped to any Ableton or third-party audio effect. Via the modular junction CV instrument, these sources can be patched into any suitable CV input in a hardware modular synthesizer for a DC coupled audio interface. Compatible hardware includes Eurorack and 5U systems. In this example, we can see we've got an Ableton grain delay effect running on a send and return channel being fed from some field recordings. And the spray, frequency and pitch have been manipulated and modulated by some of the modulation sources inside the modular junction. You can visit these sources and actually see, for example, using a mod table, which can be thought of as a wavetable based LFO. This is stepping through each section of the wavetable in synchronization to the playback tempo of the live set. We can also see in our example down here, we've got some ramps running some short envelope contour to manipulate our frequency parameter. And also we are using some eight stage envelopes and some function generators to manipulate the feedback and also the pitch of the grain delay device. In this example, this is an instance of the Ableton analog device racked up with a modular junction to provide many more modulation sources. You can think of the modular junction as a modulation synthesis expansion for any software instrument. In this example, we can see of an LFO modulating our pitch envelope for oscillator one. We can see we've got a short amount of pitch shift here. If we look inside the LFO, we can see here we're using an exponential envelope curve running at a slow rate in bipolar mode. We're also using LFO2 here to change the speed of LFO2 inside the native device. So we can actually map modulation sources to other types of modulation source within our device. This can provide some really interesting modulation sources in your patches. We've got another instance of the mod table here running. We can see here stepping through uh, an eighth note pulse, and this is being used to modulate the pulse width of oscillator wave shape two inside the analog device. The modular junction ships with 48 wavetable LFO sources, and you can load your own in if you've made them with the Metafunction WaveWorld device, a free device available from our site. So the modular junction provides a lot more modulation possibilities for synthesis instruments and samplers inside live, alongside audio effects from not only Ableton, but any third-party device.